We think of street food as greasy hot dogs, but in Mexico, it's a whole different kettle of fish. There's a huge variety on offer, all freshly prepared and cooked in front of your eyes. And what's more, it tastes as good as anything you might get in a decent restaurant back home. These are soft corn tortillas cooked fresh off the grill and you can have any type of filling in them. One of my favourites is black beans. Amen. Amazing, thank you. And here's my black bean recipe. There are so many tempting meat dishes in Mexico that you'd be forgiven for thinking that the vegetarians would have a seriously hard time. But not so, there are thousands of delicious vegetarian things to eat. And these black beans are not only satisfying, but they're incredibly Moorish. I've got a shallot in my blender really easy and I'm going to get a clove of garlic just want to take the skin off so I'm going to bash it and then the skin slips off really easily and I'm going to throw that into the blender too garlic and beans work really well together the juice of a lime which will really just liven up that lovely meaty black bean flavour for the black beans I just buy a carton and they're so easy to use and I'm just going to throw these straight into the blender too, along with all the liquid. And I'm just going to whiz those up. And it's really as simple as that. That's all there is to it. So now what I want to do is get my second carton of black beans. Drained black beans. I'm going to put a tiny bit of olive oil in my pan. And now I'm going to add everything to it. First of all, my processed beans. Oh, and it already smells delicious. And my whole black beans, which I've drained off as well. They just need a little bit of seasoning, salt, and then lots of black pepper. And I like to use a pinch of cumin. And that essentially is a building block of the whole dish. And I can't tell you how delicious it's going to be. We want some feta. Feta is very like a cheese called queso fresco, which they use a lot in Mexico. And it's got a lovely saltiness that really brings alive the flavour of the black beans. I'm going to crumble that over. Now I'm going to use one of Mission salsas. Now you can use any type of salsa. I love their mild one because it's just got a lovely fresh flavour. So I'm just going to spoon some of this on and it will really liven up the flavour of those black beans. And you can serve it like that, but I like to add a little bit of chopped chilli and some fresh herbs as well. And I'm just using the tip, which really has no heat at all. So you don't need to worry about blowing your head off and a tiny bit of coriander. Chop that on top. And that is it, a lovely little garnish that will add colour and flavour. And there you are, it really is that simple. And if you'd like, for an extra crunch, you can deep fry the tortillas to make tostadas. And there's a recipe for that in my book, Mexican Food Made Simple.